to some, a villain to others. And wherever he rode, people spoke his name in whispers. This year's story starts one morning bright and early with me taking a little trip through the countryside. The trip was a mite unpleasant, since fellas conducting it were a smidgen on the uncivilized side. Even if they was nice enough to <coughs> knock the dust off of me. You shouldn't have shot our sister, Hex. Damn soft tried to bushwhack me. Spitting backer juice in her eye while she was lying there dying. That's low. I was spitting at the hole I shot in her head. I was a mite off because I'd been sick. Damn! Damn again! Where in hell is he? Right here, you pole cat! Yeah, my marksmanship ain't so good, son. But I shoot long enough, I finally hit something. I ain't got no beef with you, son. Ha! Missed one of the horses, Grandpa. You complaining, son? I'm just stating a fact. I owe you one. I was bounty hunting these fellas anyway, but the way I figured, you owe me three. Reckon you're right. Name's Hex. Jonah Hex. I heard of you. You're a bounty hunter, too. And I guess you heard of me. Slow Go Smith. Nope. Oh. Well, he won't need this no more. Reckon not. You want to split what these fellas got? I don't pick dead man's pockets. Good. I got me an expensive backy habit. And I always liked the notion of having me a watch. Wish I knew how to tell time. All of these fellas to Mud Creek might be a little bothersome. I just take enough of them back to get my money. Well, that's one way of doing business. This horse you missed. Reckon I'll take up with him, you don't mind. Unless, of course, you done shot your own. And if I did mind? Reckon it wouldn't matter much. That's what I figured. Might have been more decent to me to pull them boys over in the bushes. Hell, old man. What's the point making it hard on the buzzards? Well, hadn't thought of that. Mud Creek was a cozy little town. Regular paradise. If he was a maggot. You think I ought to light it? It'd just go out, you fool. Y'all spread out there. Wave that there fly off in the hole in his head, will you? Hey, gents, wait up a minute. Fellas want to buy some postcards of the Price Gang? They ain't the ones we got laid out now. Them's the Treywicks over there. That right. The Treywicks. Bunch of fellas surprised them coming out of the cafe this morning afore they could do any robbing and such. How about that? Shot living hell out of every last one of them. How many did you shoot? <laughs> Wasn't around then. Actually, I'm more in charge of Chamber of Commerce activities. That's so. Ain't no cards of the Treywicks. That's a disappointment. But we got pictures of the Price Gang, and we got them stuffed over at the livery. You want to look? Uh, cost you a nickel to see them. No thanks. Wouldn't want them with blood all over them. What blood? Yarn. You don't get away from me. He threatened me! That ugly bastard threatened me! 
Be glad Threaten is all he did. Scar like that, don't you know who that is? You mean... no. Yeah, that's Jonah Hex, his own damn self. He's killed more men than hell has souls. Oh, rat friendly, little Berg. Yeah, let's you and me move here. What can I do you for, gents? I'll be needing some money for these. Mm. What? That there's the Treywicks, not the hombres y'all got laid out. Y'all shot them other men for eating breakfast. That's right, Sheriff. Me and the Treywicks is kind of close. And them heads belong to them. Hell, hope them other fellas ain't nobody anybody knows. That could be embarrassing, couldn't it? You're... Jonah Hex, ain't you? Yep. I've heard about that scar. How'd you come by it? Damn toothpick slept. You're one funny hombre, ain't you? Folks always tell me that. Well, you boys are out of luck. Money for the reward was split up between the town folks for them boys down there in the boxes. Meaning? Meaning there ain't no damn money. Feller shot them boys drunk it up. I have to wait a couple of days till I can get a voucher through. You can pick it up then. Now, where'd I lay that dang bottle? Can't just shoot someone and get paid anymore. Let me buy you a drink, slow go. I already got some, but uh, I'll come and watch. I raise. Yeah, give me two. I'll see that. Yeah. I'll see you. Yeah. I'm on. Give me another whiskey. What's well, for you, gents? Give us a whiskey. And wipe the damn bar. We wiped the bar on Mondays. That's a nasty scar, mister. How'd you get it? Cut myself shaving. Oh, <laughs> Hey, engine! Honey! Come here to wipe this up. <laughs> With your tongue, you red slut! Finish that, you can lick my boots. I like a right nice polish, girly. <laughs> Why are you down there, boy? Lick your buddy's boots. He wants them clean so bad. No. No, they're fine. I heard you say you wanted them licked. Me too. I don't see so good, but I hear right smart. I don't lick no one's boots for nobody. <gasps> I say you're a boot-licking son of a bitch and you'd suck the jam from between a dead man's toes. It's just an Indian, mister. He licks the boots, or eats lead. Huh? Yeah. Bite them boots. Be sure and get just under the toe. Lot of old stuff jams up there. Why'd you throw your damn guns, Logo? Figured I had a better chance of hitting them that way. Good thinking. Here are you or him bothering this here gal again. Me and Slow Go will feed you something ain't as tasty as them boots. Count on it. Buffalo gals, won't you come out tonight? Come out tonight. Come out tonight. Buffalo gals, won't you come out tonight? I ain't a dance Need a couple rooms. I ain't got but one. You got bugs. Took a bath in kerosene a week ago. Killed him. You snore? I ain't got no truck with snorers. I ain't never stayed up to find out. <laughs> Give us a room. <laughs> if there's one thing I can't abide, it's a snore. <laughs> You sound like an army of bad carpenters. Sleep in the barn. Hex, you contrary fart. I saved your life. And I just saved yarn. Use anyone else, I'd have shot you. Sleep at the stable with the horses.
damn person and get a son of a... I don't normally let nobody sleep here. It ain't good business. I don't want to do no damn business. I want to sleep. I'll charge you the same as your horse. These them stuff price fellas, ain't they? Don't reckon they're nobody else. And I figure you owe me a nickel for the look you're getting. My partner Hex said put these sleeping quarters on his livery bill. So add the damn nickel, too. Can't go back to sleep. Guess I could count and shoot sheep. Ah! Oh, if it ain't one damn thing, it's two. Hell, ain't you dead yet? Sounded like the racket was coming from the livery. Figured that'd be slow go. He wasn't snoring. He was shooting. <laughs>